Ooh, man. What's going on, guys? My name is Bry Plays, and welcome to a quick little video I wanted to film. We need to talk about the NBA game that I just witnessed. It's Kings vs. Rockets, okay? Kings vs. Rockets. Kings are down by two with two minutes left to go. Keegan Murray, my guy, Keegan Murray, gets a clutch charge, charge foul against the he takes the charge, and it's just clutch, okay? That's what starts all this. That's what starts all this. And then, they don't score. But that is okay, because you got Mr. Clutch, De'Aaron Fox, pulling up, making his shots, making his elbow shots, doing everything he can to deliver us the win. But that's not all. That's not all. So, it is, fast forward to about... 10 seconds left in the game, okay? Fast forward to about 10 seconds left in the game. Kings are down by two, not looking good. And Rockets have the inbound. And it's Malik Monk comes up with the clutch steal to give us the ball. And as soon as that happens, it is 0.8 left on the clock. So I guess it wasn't 10 seconds. It was more like maybe three seconds. Rockets are inbounding the ball. Think we're done. We're thinking we're done. And then Malik Monk uh, comes up with the clutch um, offensive turnover or just creates that Rockets turnover, I guess, um, and has the ball. And after that, after that, Mike Brown calls the instant timeout with 0.8 seconds left in the game. So they're like, okay, the Kings better throw one up here. So they get the ball out of the timeout, get an inbound to Fox. Okay, so Fox just throws up a prayer, okay? It's literally just a prayer shot. Like, no chance of going in. But then I realized something, that it's an, uh, an unnatural landing position. So I'm like, did he get fouled? And when we look on the replay, he did indeed get fouled by Aaron... Sorry, not Aaron. I mess this up all the time. Air, not Aaron. Eric Gordon... He does get fouled by Eric Gordon, and since it is a heave, he gets fouled at the three-point line, which gives the Kings three shots, down by two. I think it was, um, since we won 130 to 128, it was 128 to 126. Wait, no, 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 my math is wrong. It's 127 to 128, yep, 127 to 128. And it's all up to De'Aaron Fox at this point. It's that's that's all we have left. And De'Aaron Fox goes up to the line. The first shot goes off the rim, bounces around the rim, and I'm thinking, okay, he's gonna miss the first one. But he doesn't. It goes in somehow, and then De'Aaron Fox ends up making the next two shots to give the Kings the win with point three seconds left to go in the clock. The Rockets fire up a prayer shot, goes off the glass, and the Kings have won the game. So I just needed to go over that because I feel like that was a very, that, that was a very unbelievable and very crazy ending. I'm still hyperventilating. I don't, I, I'm a pretty diehard Kings fan, so I'm still hyperventilating after that one. Um, Sacramento gets the win, improves to 31 wins on the season. Um, already eclipsing their win total of last season, man. Man, this season has been special for us, baby. Light the beam. Let's go, Kings.